Hello, in this video we are going to learn how to view and edit text files using our graphical text editor gedit. So right now if I go here to my desktop and then as you can see here I have two uh, text files namely commands and Linux. So what if I want to open for example the commands text file? It's very simple. All you need to do is just say gedit and then the name of the file that you want to open which in this which is in this case commands so if I hit enter uh, this will show you my file and here I included like some of the commands that we have learned so far with a very brief description okay and as you can see it's very simple I can for example edit the file I can add stuff to it so here I will say gedit is the default uh, graphical text editor editor for the graphical uh, for the gnome desktop okay so as you can see gedit is very simple to use you can add stuff you can delete stuff if you want to and then you just save here you see it's pretty much self uh, explanatory right and if I can save here and then I close and if I want to open it up again to see if my changes are made as you can see everything is updated and, and so on right so it's very very simple to use and I can do the same thing for my Linux file so if I want to open it up I'll just say gedit Linux and it will view my file here I include some of the uh, uh, most popular Linux uh, distributions out there here I have Ubuntu Debian OpenSUSE, Fedora, CentOS, Manjaro, and etc. Okay, and as you can see, I can maybe like delete the top, the last five here. I will save, and then I will, if I open it up again, I will see my changes are made. Okay, awesome. So as you can see, it's very very simple to use. But right now, I already have these two files, right? What if I want to create another file? So it's very simple. You just say gedit and the name of your the file that you want to create so I will just if you for example want to create uh, a text file called cats so you'll just do that right and here you can say for example cats are better than dogs which I don't think so I don't believe in this eh and I will just save it right and then if I close it open it up again I will see my file okay as you can see I, I have my file here so if you already have a file then it will open it up for you and you can do whatever you want with it if you don't have the file it will create it for you and that's pretty much everything that you need to know about gedit it's very very simple to use right okay that's it for this video ciao